Hello guys, how's it going? My name is Dalren, and today I want to show you guys the one-shot macro that I've constructed for Outlaw Rogues. And this is a macro that you guys can have fun messing around with when trying to play Outlaw. I understand that a lot of people have a difficulty trying to figure out where to begin with Outlaw Rogues. Or people that have been playing Outlaw want to improve, but not quite sure how they should structure their abilities. So what this macro will do is basically give you one button to press for your burst. It will need a little bit of a lineup, so I'll leave that one up to you. But for the most part, this does literally everything else for you. So, let's go over the macro. Alright, so we have this macro and we have a general rush, curse of the jet blades, and plunder armor in order to increase the damage as much as possible. And then we continue with saber slash run through, saber slash run through, back to back to back to back. And this is basically how it bursts an alpha world. There's a little bit extra that can be added to this macro in terms of a little bit extra damage that you can put out. But it is really difficult to write a macro for what you're trying to accomplish. So what you can do is separate it into two different macros. The first aspect of this you will also want to establish Thick as Thieves. Which is why this macro is very effective when opening up from stealth. Because you can establish a Tricks of Trade on a nearby friendly, open up with a cheap shot, pop your burst and then go through the macro. So then you can kind of have the damage built up from the get go. If you are using this macro however outside of stealth, you will want to line up 6 combo points or 5 before you open a target, before you hit him with a between the eyes, make sure you're not hitting anybody, thick as thieves, use tricks of trade to tricks a friendly target nearby, then use between the eyes, then go on to using the macro. So I think the easiest way to go about it is from stealth, where you can just uh, trick of, tricks of trade a friendly target before you go, cheap shot, and then go on spamming your abilities. So let's take a look at how this macro functions in a against a train dummy. So I have myself set up, I'm ready to go, I'm going to open up with a cheap shot, I'm actually, before I go, what helps out a ton if you are able to do this, mark for death, roll the bones to see what buffs you get. And it doesn't really matter what buffs you get, I got grand melee, if I got crit buff that would have been awesome, but this is something you can do in BGs in case you get a crit buff. But it doesn't really matter whether you get a crit buff or not, because the damage you put out is insane as it is. Alright, so here we go. Yes, it's working, it is working, and in, against a trained dummy like this, you can't use plunder armor properly. So then you won't be able to use this macro in the same way. So plunder armor simply won't be applied for this macro and just won't properly work. Mainly because against train as you can see, you can't use plunder armor against them to steal their armor. But against a player versus uh, a player target, you will be able to use plunder armor properly. So it'll work fine. So this macro, it works. Well, let me actually just go and add on to this macro just a little bit more. I think I'm just going to add a bunch of saber slashes to it. Because this macro does last for 15 seconds, but in case you continue doing damage, which you should have about uh, 10 seconds worth of, just a few more saber slashes, and we're good to go. Nice. So now we have a macro where you basically spam and saber slash run through back to back to back, while a curse of the blades, adrenaline rush, and blunder armor is activated. And this is more or less what I do for my macro, except all I do is combine all these buffs separately, uh, all these buffs together, but then I go through my rotation separately. So what this macro will do, it will allow you to burst as an outlaw rogue. Whether it be in the opener or after you line up combo points and then you're about to stun. It can also help you to deal more damage as an outlook if you're grabbing thick as thieves, you use uh, tricks of trade and you tricks the target before you go opening up with a stun. So it's all up to you how you want to do this and how you want to prioritize all these abilities. Again, this macro is basically for you guys to play around with, especially if you're somebody who is fairly new to the Outlaw Rogue class or want to learn Outlaw Rogue class. Or if you're not really picking up on it, even if you've been playing for a while, this is something for you guys to have fun in BGs. So hopefully you guys enjoy some of the clips that I have of me just one-shotting and obliterating people with how much damage an Outlaw Rogue is able to do. Hopefully you guys have a great day. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Dal. Enjoy the clips. And I'll see all of you in the next video.
speaking out what we're going 